Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we will discuss blending theory of inheritance. In 18th century, biologist proposed a theory to explain how characters are passed from parents to offspring. And this theory was called blending theory of inheritance. So let's understand this theory with the example. Suppose here I have a plant with red flowers and I have another plant of same species with white flower. So we have two parents, a plant with red flower and plant with white flower. When I cross them, I will get pink flower. According to blending theory of inheritance, this F1 of spring will be pink flower. So these plants from cross between red flower and white flower will be pink flower. So here from this plant, this, this plant get their trait from this plant red from there and white from there and then they blended they mixed and after mixing between red and white we know it will be pink color and then when we cross this pink flower plant with another pink flower plant all flowers will be pink so here according to this theory characters of both parents mixes together and new trait arises by mixing two existing traits that are present in parents. So here we have two traits, red and white. They mix together and they form pink color. And the traits that are mixed together, they will never separate again according to this theory. So this is theory of, you can say, blending inheritance. But later on, this theory was discarded. Why it was discarded? Because we know that in reality, when we cross between red and white flower plant, we will get pink. But when we cross between pink and pink, we will get red, pink and also white. So this theory could not explain how these traits red and white that were disappeared in F1 generation appeared in F2 generation. How they appeared? So this theory could not explain this appearance of trait that were not present in F1, that were present in parental generation, but not present in F1, but they appeared in F2. So this theory was, later on, this theory was discarded. But in 18th century before Mendel, this theory of blending inheritance was very popular. Even Charles Darwin was the supporter of this theory. So this is theory of blending inheritance. It says that character of both parents mixes together and new trait arises by mixing them. And these characters that are mixed, they will never separate again. But in reality, it's not true. We know that we, when we cross between pink and pink, we will get red, pink and white. So it could not explain how characters that were disappeared previously appeared in next generation. So that's why this theory was discarded.